Hi guys. So, um, yesterday I did a video about the confirmation, um, of Monday, an event. Um, there was some more information coming in that, um, there's been explosions over in Michigan by F-16s and there has been, uh, thousands of Marines that the Biden administration just sent over to the Middle East and we have the a big event um, from uh, the Homeland Security that has sent out letters to law enforcement stating that they need to be prepared um, for an attack and so I am thinking that this attack would be from the illegal immigrants as over in, I don't know if you guys seen in England that any illegals that anybody was coming against anti-illegal, they were shooting them, stabbing them and killing them. Um, and it's, it's a big deal because that's exactly what's coming to America. Um, and it reminds me of the purge, kind of like how it was like three days of being able to do whatever you want, so on and forth, so forth. Um, and so this event, um, like I said, I don't know a hundred percent because God never revealed to me what the event is, but having this information as well as knowing that we have another geomagnetic storm, um, that's going to affect our pole shift with the hurricane and the EMP, um, with the electric grid, the blackout, it would all just make sense if it all just went out at once, um, with these terrorist attacks and things. And if you guys remember the dream that I had of the Palestinians that were over in America and they were killing people and raping them and uh, dragging them off and stuff. I'm not here to scare anybody or, you know, do a fear mongering because that's not what I'm here to do. Um, because we aren't supposed to fear and God tells us that. Obviously, he's go he wins in the end. He tramples down the enemy. So, I'm just here to state that um, that would be another possibility as um, Israel just gave a warning to Iran that if they attack, what they're going to do is destroy Damascus, which is Isaiah 17, and we see the fulfillment of Psalm 83 war. Um, the Bible is not in chronological order, and I know a lot of people believe that it is, but it is not, and that's why different events go with different scriptures in the Bible, and why you have to study to know who they're talking to and where the placement is. So... Having said that, um, many of these things are getting ready to pop off and I believe it's within days. Um, I, and I believe also this stuff triggers the rapture. I don't know the day or hour. I feel it's any day. I feel it's any time and I feel an awareness more so in my spirit than anything. And I believe that our animals, especially mine, like last night, I believe that they are able to sense stuff into the spiritual realm. And I believe that they have more of a sense than us humans because they have such sharp hearing. Um, and my animals have been barking nonstop, especially at night, as if something is there. And I have looked everywhere on our property. There's night, no coyotes. There's no animals, nothing. And I believe that they are sensing something because I can feel um, the shift in the atmosphere of the demonic activity. I know a lot of you also can feel that too. So... Um, that's just a little message here. Um, things are about to happen. Just be guarded in your heart, mind, and soul uh, with Jesus Christ and know that, you know, he's the protector of all. And he tells us not to fear. He tells us that over and over again. He's got us. Okay? So whatever's going to happen, just be mindful, be watchful, and know that no matter what, God's got us. I'll see you there in the air. God bless.